We're here with Chris Lewis, chairman of Biggles Wage United, who's going to tell us about his very kind gesture on Tuesday night. Yeah, so Tuesday night we have a, uh, a game against Hitchin Town at uh, Biggles Wage United's ground. We're going to be kicking off at 8pm. Uh, and effectively what's happening is we are raising, looking to raise money uh, for Hitchin Town with their uh, their battle, um, as it were, to save Topfield, their, their ground. Um, so effectively what's going to be happening is we're playing against Hitchin Town and all the gate receipts will be going towards, uh, will be going towards Hitchin Town effectively so that they can uh, put money towards their legal fees um, and various other angles to help support uh, the, the campaign to help save their ground. So that's what we're looking to do. Uh, we're hoping that obviously Hitchin Town will bring down as many fans as possible. The more people we can get in, the better, uh, which is obviously what we're looking for. Um, we've got a number of guests coming down. We have Guillaume Balaguet, who's the uh, who's Pickles Wage United's director of football. He's obviously been well behind this and he's been uh, helping us to, to really push this forward. Um, not only is he coming down, but we also have uh, the Sky Sports News presenter, Jim White, uh, who's a personal friend of Guillaume, so he's coming down as well. And also the uh, ex-Chelsea and Republic of Ireland legend that is Tony Cascarino. He's uh, very kindly offered to come down as well and help support the, uh, the event. So we're hoping that that will help pull in as many people as possible uh, to come down and support the event. Like I say, the more money that we can raise, the more people we can get through the door, the, uh, the better it will be for Hitchin Town. Fantastic, and that's, that's a tremendous show of solidarity at, at this sort of level. What, can I ask, what, what made you guys sort of uh, get involved in that? Well, I mean, we've heard uh, previously that you know, Guillaume has been involved with, with this whole event with uh, Hitchin Town. Um, he helped lead a march um, before Christmas, which was really well attended. Um, I think over about 1,500 people I think, turned up for the event in Hitchin. Um, so it's a case where with Guillaume's involvement in that we wanted to help. Um, Guillaume's obviously a massive part of the club now and we wanted to be able to you know, help Hitchin Town. They're only just down the road from us really. Um, so both non-league teams. I think it was a good gesture for, for the club to be able to help in any way that we could. Obviously you don't want to see uh, fellow non-league teams struggle with this sort of problem. So we thought it would be a good idea to help with that. Fantastic, fantastic. And just in terms of uh, your plans going forward for Biggles Wage United, can we expect more Galacticos off the pitch? <laughs> <laughs> it would be nice to think so. We've already signed uh, Enrique De Lucas, uh, former Chelsea and Espanyol player, which has obviously been uh, well documented on, on Sky. Guillaume Balaguer was on there the other day on Transfer Denly Day, so that went really well. Uh, we may bring in a few other players, we'll wait and see. Obviously there's not too much information we can give away at this stage. <laughs> But hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll bring in some good players along the way, yeah. Excellent, so watch this space then. Yeah, it's a, definitely. Brilliant. We're here with uh, Guillaume Balagay, Sky Sports legend and Hitchin resident, who's uh, here to tell us about a very important game coming up this Tuesday. Yeah, it is It is an important game. Uh, obviously, Beagles Wade, at Beagles Wade, uh, United, we are we are playing uh, Hitchin Town as a friendly. As you know, like, because you part, you've been very close to everything that's been going on. We need to continue raising funds for Hitchin Town. Uh, we have to keep fighting to save uh, top field. And as part of it, uh, as part of a, a profile raising kind of event, uh, we've got this friendly, but it's not just any friendly. Uh, we're doing it on a day where you, we think a lot of people will be able to come by the sound of it, by the feedback that we're getting. A lot of people will be there in the hundreds, and the money that we raise at Bigel where United will be just go, uh, going out to Hayton Town for the for the costs uh, that a campaign like that uh, it just keeps raising, doesn't it? We're going to have uh, Jim White is going to be present, uh, Tony Cascarino who's a local boy as well, as in lives nearby, he's going to be there as well. Uh, I was talking to uh, Mark Hasley uh, about coming and, uh, and doing the refereeing and he was almost uh, said yes but then he realised that he had to be in Spain but he'll be all involved in future things. So all in all it's, um, it's going to be a good, uh, a good night out and, uh, and, and both managers, uh, Mark and Mick, are looking forward to it and so are the players. Fantastic. I don't know where uh, you played a prominent part in the in the in the Save Hitchin Town campaign in the March before Christmas. Um, how important is non-league football, in the, just in terms of solidarity shown between big as well? Well, I'm I'm amazed because I, I cannot claim to say that I knew about. Um, this level of football before, but in the last year I've been involved in a lot of things. Bigglesway United is growing by the day. Uh, the signing of, uh, of the Lucas was a massive thing everywhere, uh, but all the things that are happening and we're setting up an academy and, and a lot of people are helping us. Now, you realise how much 
passion there is and how much time people have for, for these kind of clubs and how much interest uh, as soon as you get involved. And, and I saw that at Hitchin, Hitchin Town, it was a fantastic day as well at the, uh, at the ground, a great victory as well at the end, at the end of the day. And, uh, and with Biggles Way United is the same, it's just as I'm saying, it's, it's feel like it's where real football is, you know. So on the day of the Hitchin Town March, I know you mentioned there was a, there was a revolution going on in non-league football. I just, I just feel there is, something is happening uh, and people are going back to those grounds and they're going back with the intention of going back again and to bring the kids and to bring the families and everybody, uh, when they have the possibilities like we are doing at Beacons Road United, we're trying to make it all comfortable for people to come in and our attendances are rising. We're not talking about 500s, we're talking already about hundreds and, and that is an improvement from, from recent years so something is happening and we have to give them something, a little bit of a spectacle, certainly results as well because uh, you know in this business we're all to win but uh, yeah I feel they're all coming back to, uh, to see us and, and I just couldn't be happy. Fantastic and obviously with your contacts book can we expect any Galacticos here? In North Hearts and uh, right, go on. Uh, you got Kika the Lucas coming, yep. but things are happening. Things are happening. You'll be the first to know. But things <laughs> are happening.